Oh, nope. He must have gone inside. Oh well. We'll try another location. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Maybe he's under the uh, bark up up above here. There he is. There he is right there. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, I'm going to lift this now. Okay. Ready? Yep. Ah. Right there on your left. Yep. Bark scorpion. And not the lizard. So this is our uh, Arizona Mountain King ideal habitat right here. Nice little moss. Mossy stream. And perhaps we'll be lucky. What? No fauna, just flora? <laughs> Jackson, you're going to look for a uh, mountain king? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Okay. There goes Jackson's father up the hill, tearing into things. Up the hill there we have another explorer who I cannot identify. Oh, that's Barry. Barry! Wave! Wave! There we go. Thank you, sir. And Jaron is somewhere up the hill. So, here we go. Off in this direction. Yeah, Alright, so can you elaborate on what this is, please? This, this is, is a long nosed snake. snake. It's okay. A lizard, eater. Good job, Acantia. A lizard eater. Okay. Yes. One and of the more beautiful snakes <laughs> around. Damn it. What? <laughs> and Did he was out here it? on Highway Did you hear? He's like, 60, I think. 60, <laughs> south of the. Uh, okay, or in New Mexico. In New Mexico. In New Mexico. Yeah. Just an, over the New Mexican border. <laughs> yeah. Okay, very Maybe good. Can... Very good. Long nosed snake. <laughs> All right. This is after having found the long nose. Everyone's piling back in. Ashley. Ashley, come on. We're here. No, Ashley, come on. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Art. Thank you. At least someone acknowledges the camera. Okay, and we're piling back in. And here we go. Okay, now what do we have here? Uh, it's kind of hard to tell what they are, but they look like spade foot. Spade Probably foots. newly hatched. Do not yeah. Is it a boy? Check. Here we go. Oh, yes. Bobby Green Rattler. Oh, he did? Where's the green toad? Oh, yeah, to see what happens. He's got the green toad. Let me see the green toad. What do you got? What happened? He's not making a noise. So is the girl. Right? Careful. Good looking animal. Right here. First of all, it's not a spade foot. No. Oh, it's perfect. It's, uh, it, doesn't, it has a big parasite gland. It's a green toad. Oh, no fly. Green toad. Green toad. Green green? Yep. Yeah. There we yeah. go. You're right, they're not green. And the pupils green. are horizontal. <laughs> That's why the only place they call them hobby green is the shelf. Okay, what's your coat? Oh, shit. I don't have a pole. A hook. It's okay. Okay, just let him. Jaron, what, what am I looking at that distinguishes that from the Mojave? The black and white the tail, tail on it. The coon tail. tail. Yeah. See how... Yeah, I found it. Okay. There's his tail. No lights. Strong black banding? Yes. Yeah. yeah. What is it? Uh, it's a uh, Aatrox. I know. It's a western diamond. How big do these get? Yeah, see how... how get six feet. Four feet. Six feet's pretty rare in yeah, Texas, that's... you'll find them. Yeah. Wait, what is this? An ice rock? Right. So, try and look out. Yeah. Okay, here he comes. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's let him go. Are they typically that quick? Yeah. No. Yes. Typically. That's slow for one of them. Okay, he's going to get tired and he'll, he'll coil up and sit for a minute now. So get your pictures. Watch the watch flashlight. Oh, perfect though. shot. Perfect, perfect shot. Oh, yeah, that looks like you're buying a store. Ashley, do yeah, it looks flashlight. like a postcard. Okay. He's going to sit and figure out what's going on. I'll be oh. the car, look out. No, cool shot. Stand over there and get a picture of him with the road. Yellow stripe. Yeah. Behind him. Yeah. Those are pretty good. Oh, I got a nice picture of you. <laughs> there you go. Shine that light right on him. Like, yeah, there you go. Very nice. Plus, if I can get him to hold okay, the tail up, so 
Ryan, you get a shot of it. Oh, that thing, that thing's mad. To the van and beyond. Van up to the high elevations. High elevations, here we come. Okay, and with the thunder in the background, we have Don here, and he's showing us something very interesting, very tiny. And what is this, Don? That's a bark scorpion. One of the nastiest little scorpions around. They'll give you a bite that'll make you wish you could cut your hand off. Okay, okay. And if we put it down there in the bucket? Uh, I gotta make sure he lets go of me before I let go of him. <laughs> okay, okay. Other than that, he can get me. Okay, and that's what they look like. Fantastic, and that was found right over here in this uh, base of, uh, what is this, a dead uh, yucca. yucca, okay, dead yucca. Okay, nice over overcast sky, and there's the van down there, the other explorers are off in that direction, and we have, uh, I believe, uh, well we just had one van, pa or one uh, truck passes in the road, but very little traffic, and Jaron and uh, Barry are off in that direction. We're uh, in the Coronado National Forest. And, and it's going to rain soon because I can feel the moisture. Definitely, definitely. We can feel the moisture and we can hear the thunder. So we have to pack up and move as, as time permits. Thank you, Don. Is the dress it hard enough to air Okay, so here we are sitting in the middle of a thunderstorm. This five, six. Waiting for it to break. In front of us is a monument. What does that monument say again? <laughs> Mormon Battalion Team. Can you can you turn the the? Okay, I'm trying to. Okay, I got most of it. Okay, there we go. No, it's fine. Jaron, look this way. There you go. There you go. Okay, thank you, Jaron. <laughs> okay. So after the uh, storm broke, we proceeded uh, outside the van, and hopefully you can see that rainbow out there, although I don't know whether the camera will pick it up or not. And right here is what we were looking at before. This is the uh, memorial to the U.S. Mormon Battalion that came through here in 1846 um, to get to California. And I think the most interesting part about this here is it said that they began cutting a road, but it then didn't work, yada yada. Oh, um, there, there was a scout who was attacked by three grizzly bears in this area. He killed one bear, which provided meat for the troops. Very interesting marker here. And we're going to proceed out into the countryside to look for some more herps. And given the rain, who knows what we'll find. But our objective is to hopefully find a box turtle or two down in the bushes. There's another uh, perspective on the pass. The road we came up, the canyon which we braved to get here. And the rain. It's coming down, so I'm going to put the camera away. Yeah, they were next to the Okay, so what, uh, now everyone tell us what it is we've discovered here. Yeah, we all ran in rock rally. Except that I didn't have this gloves on. Let me know when you're ready. Go. We, we, we're ready, we're ready. Go. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. This is Lepidus clobberi from Where the pollen seals. If you look at it, it's got real nice thick white bands compared to the rest of the, rattler, the rock rattlers. Usually have a littler band on them. Uh, it could be a different subspecies because it's been isolated here for since the beginning of time. Um, they're a very, very, very nice rattlesnake if you're into collecting rattlesnakes. Fascinating. And you Leprous say clobberi. Leprous clobberi and the, the white banding is is is, is indicative of this the, particular Yeah, and then subspecies. you can see the little the little spots on the side of it uh -huh, there. Uh -huh. That's uh, more common in this area. If you remember the one we seen at the other side on the Huachucas? No, he's got a little bit of orange on it, and no, then old, the old. Very brown oh. Oh. Ah, well, we've lucked out then here. We've yeah. got quite a and bit. And this is probably actually let, let he was put him back. He was probably out hunting, and he was probably just let me put him back. Went underneath that one rock there. That was funny, but here's scary. a grub. <laughs> 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 
That's up. Okay, so I mean, you know, they're they're here. Gotta pay attention. Oh, there's babies. Mother Scorpio with babies. Oh, oh wow. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get a, a video of this. Scorpion. Get a video okay. of this. And that's the rock Art. scorpion there. Art. Scorpion, uh. Okay, the one we saw before was similar to this. That's had scary. really brown claws. Yeah, big yeah, claws, claws like that. How do we like that. do it without killing it? I don't want to crush it. How do I... Uh... We'll, we'll go slow. He's like, oh, we're... No, don't crush no. it. No, when, when they're done taking pictures of it, we'll put it outside and Where let it crawl back underneath. Okay. Okay. A video of it. Oh, wait, wait, wow. Look at all the babies. So let him get a video. Yeah, the males Those are all the babies? babies. That's gross. Oh, the males one? Yeah. You guys keep finding stuff under each rock. I bet Come you every on, rock here has something. Okay. Everybody got a picture of them? Oh, yeah. How do we move them? Ow! Okay, wow. Well, I was not as optimistic about this area, but this is turned to be rather profitable right here in the pass, not far from the van there where we were looking on the other ridge where we waited out the thunderstorm. And now we're looking under every rock. Yes. Now we're a bunch of rock fanatics. Scorpion! And another scorpion. Another scorpion. Scorpions are really common up here. Oh, really? Look at that little yes. guy. A tiny it's little alive? That's why I put my glove on. Tiny okay. scorpion. What? In the mud. This one going toward us. Toward me. Go. <gasps> I don't see anything at this rock. <laughs> very good. Very, very good. Uh, don't back up your foot because of scorpions. Okay, you guys, remember where that rock rattler is so you don't go standing next to it. Where is it? Which one was the rock rattler? Oh, the hole underneath it? Right here. Randy, I think that we need to get together here. Yeah. Check this rock right here. We just did that one. Oh, this one has a hole underneath it. Anything, Barry? Okay, well, don't want to waste any more film, but this has been very profitable. Well, the winds begin to pick up a little, but we're still here in the same spot. Rainbow in the background there. More uh, clouds on the way. Still looking for anything under these rocks, scorpion, centipede, or otherwise. spot we've turned up quite a bit in just a short period of time. Scorpion there too, Don? Yeah, about a half inch long. That's yeah, let's uh, get this live this time. <laughs> you, you see him there still? Yeah. All right. That's yeah. Yeah. There we are. Oh, this oh one is just old. vanished. Just vanished. Well, that's what happens. It's been very fruitful, though. Very fruitful. And on we go. Hey there. Hello. Okay. What have you? What well, is it you found? Turning over rocks has yielded a few more little goodies to look at. Okay. I'm not sure how well it's going to come out, but we certainly. Here, why don't we give them a little poke and make them run? Here. Now oh, he's getting defensive there. There he is. Yep, yep, yep. Come on, buddy. Come Pose on. for the camera. There we go. There we go. Very okay. sharp looking fella. Mm -hmm. he and he vanished. And uh, there was a centipede here too somewhere, which you say is burrowed in right somewhere there. under there. Okay. So. Very, very smart. Everything here seems to be turning up something. Very. Okay, well here we have the different type of scorpion. This is the rock scorpion. I hope this will stay in focus the whole way. You can see his larger pinchers and his uh, different, slightly different body type. Oops, they're removed. On the feeling the approach of Barry here, and we're still in this very 
wet moist environment after the recent rain with the cacti and the homo sapiens and what are you pointing at there Barry? Yeah, let's, see let's see if anything's under here. No go? No go, nope, no go. But this fellow is trying to go and he's a good looking one. Good looking rock scorpion. There we go. Okay, well as you can see in here, we are at the uh, pass and the water is now running down the other side of the hill. And uh, we're going to videotape one of these many stream crossings, which we happen to uh, have uh, crossed, just to document the fun. And no, you're not seeing things in reverse. That is actually Jaron backing across the stream so that we can document him coming forward across the stream. <laughs> Little does he know he's being videotaped right now. Okay, so on three. Three, two, one, go. And here we go across the stream. Dun dun dun. <laughs> With about as big a splash as you can <laughs> muster. <laughs> and there we go. Okay, so Wood Owl Stowe, the easiest way to tell is by the cranial crest on the top of his head. You see these big ridges on the top of his head there? Mm -hmm. Yeah. The stripe down his back. Some people call them. this is the uh, oh, house the eye, right? Yeah, there's a couple of varieties of. And we can hear the. Uh, is this a male with that yeah, sound? Yeah, so it's a male. That's why he's making that little <laughs> little noise. He's afraid somebody's going to grab and try to breed with him. Okay. <laughs> Woodhouse is oh. toad. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's the uh, male tarantula. If you look at its front two little. Two uh, legs, two he front, has hooks on them, little... and then Hold on, the two front time. short legs have what are called palipops on them. That's the best way to tell they're male. The males do uh, roam where the females uh, live in the holes. He'll go by and tap around and she'll come out and he'll Make sure we don't grab her and breed her. Okay, so he's he's roaming he's, at the he's moment. Raising yeah, his he's butt. actually getting mad. He's alarmed, he's raising his butt in the air and if he kicks the hair off of his butt, it That's gets on your arm, it's itchy. Stuff. Okay. It'll irritate your skin a lot. Well, thank you, you Mr. Tarantula. Okay. Yep, uh, Scuchilatus, the uh, Mojave Green. Scuchilatus, baby Mojave probably Green. Probably with Aww. maybe four or five days old. Uh, you want the light off? Oh, where's the mom? Uh, no, on actually would be nice. Did you say four or five? Days Four or five old. days old. It's yeah. very young yeah, snake. Yeah. yeah. So there's probably more. So this is a baby, be, yeah. and we got to watch out for others because there could be more. Yep. And as you can see, he's pretty small. <coughs> Tiny oh, little baby. All righty. Hey, can I have a light over here, just so I can get a better shot of him? Here we go. <sighs> Too bad they have fangs. And there's his little itty bitty button. Alright, this is a western. Yeah, western diamondback. Hey! <laughs> Could someone shine more light on him? There we go. Here he comes. Yep, yep. Alright. Not rattling. They have a lot more black on the tail. I see that. Now. Yeah, see the black, black and white. And white. Wait, what yeah, kind right. is this? The the this is a western. That looks like the one that I saw before the Aztec or something. Aztec. Yeah. It's not the same one. Yeah. 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 That's it. Oh. Uh, this is the Texas horn lizard. If you look, the most telling way is by look at the horns. He's got two distinct horns in the back, and the big blotches on the back of him, and the white stripe down his back. Most of them have a right but it's not that distinct and they range from about uh, south of Tucson into Texas. Phrynosoma what Randy? Uh, <laughs> I didn't couldn't. learn that one because I never needed to till now. Yeah. But they're uh, they're pretty cool. They used to be really common in the pet trade but this is another one that has to have the red ant to survive with. And then here we'll grab him and we'll show you his underbelly and see if it's a little boy or a little girl. Oh, his oh. hole's right there. Grab him, Don. Grab him, grab him. Oh. 
The slowest lizard in the desert, and you can't catch it. To the hole. There he is. No, middle of the bush. Yeah. Right there. Towards you. Oh, I touched you. Letting you? No, he's horning me. Oh. He's a horned toad. Horned yeah. out. Yep. Uh, somebody else, I got him pinned down there, but he's okay, gouging me with his horn. These kind of pretty good at he's got him. blood, too. I got him. Oh, yeah, yeah they the dry. blood. Oh. Fred is somewhat carnutum. Oh. Carnutum. Maybe it'll spurt blood out of his yeah. All right, it's smile for the camera. There you go. Phrenosoma carnutum. Look at the blood. horns. I gotta get my camera. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's It's careful. amazing how spiny the back really is mm -hmm. compared to others. Now let's see where the uh, the horns are. look sharper than the what? Others. Oh, they are sharp. They're like little thorns. Okay. Okay. Key characters. Can you uh, dark stripes can you do on, the? On. Okay. The yeah. To the side. Okay. Dark stripes <laughs> radiate from the eyes. Yeah. There you go. Prominent white dorsal stripe, two fringes of a large pointed. Well, here we are, out in some of the plains. There's uh, Randy out there looking for things, and a couple other folks further in, I think. It's too bad there aren't some entomologists on this trip because we've been finding caterpillars all over the place. I don't know if you can get a look at that. But that's one of them. There's another one that's uh, has spots on it. This one's a striped one. But uh, oh, and it sounds like someone's found something over there. So we'll go check it out. Please elaborate on this, Jaron. Uh, what are these? Are the uh, round-tailed horn lizard? If you look at their tail, you see they got a little round tail on them. Uh, no, I can't. But oh, there we go. Okay, got, got it. Got that little round tail. Oh, yes, I see and it. Then also, when you if they don't take off running, they just arch their back and put their head down, they look like one of these rocks. They do! The way I found this one was I reached down to pick up one of those uh, agates and he took off running. Very good. One of these! Alright, so here's another variation of the same thing. Yep, that's oh, just that's lighter so color. Cute. Lighter coloration. I'll show you. I have a picture. Very good. Don spotted that one. Oh gosh. Can we get a picture of him on his habitat? Here's Barry, and we got to go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. No, I don't know much about it other than it's got plenty of legs, so <laughs> it's looking like an elegy. Okay, here, why don't we put it on a surface that you can, uh, we can see it a little bit better. It sort of blends in with your uh, glove there. All right. Oh, uh, there we go. Okay. And this is a, unfortunately we don't have an entomologist on the trip, but this is on the same plane as the horn lizards and the um, caterpillars we found a, Pieces of millipede. You were saying you found a bigger one somewhere else? Yeah, uh, almost twice that long. Wow. Not quite twice, mm -hmm. but uh, dark. Yeah, it's about seven inches maybe or something like that. Very good. Okay. We've got a checkered whip tail here. Beautiful long oh, tail. Yeah, really nice one. And I don't know that it's even going to come up in the video because it's so hard to see. I'm going to try and get a little closer. If you go from the side, it might be easier. You can see this. Well, basically, we're going to get so close that he's going to move. That, you're that gonna scare him away, there. and then I'll lose my picture opportunity. Oh, here we'll. I'll be upset. I'll be crying. <laughs> checkered. There he is. His head's moving a little. Okay, that's the checkered whiptail. Very good. All female. They reproduce by fertilizing their own eggs. Parthenogenic. Parthenogenic. Thank you. I've been trying to remember that word. And now we're going to say. Okay, so elaborate. Gorgeous. Sonora. Sonora gopher. Yeah, that's the one I have. I have a little one at home. Okay. Boy, he's hard to all fit in the camera. Yeah, get a good yeah. shot of that head. That's a classic oh, defensive posture. No, he looks oh. like a rattlesnake. Oh, yeah. He's got oh, yeah. You're shake his tail, oh, too. Oh, yeah, but not that Great job. Beautiful. They don't hurt. Do uh, <laughs> Interesting. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he's a nice one. Oh. Oh. Raised head and everything. Yeah, he's got the whole pole. Oh, don't let any cars down. Oh, yeah, I've got to back. Oh, God, he's so pretty. Yeah, he's yeah. back. back. He's he's not a rattlesnake? Can we make him? No, it's first time I've seen These will bite. They'll bite? No, I haven't. They bite? Yeah, but see, he's calm now. Look at his head's normal size. Yeah, oh wow, that's a dramatic change. Yeah. Nice. But he was certainly yeah. was bluffing. Certainly was bluffing. Fantastic. Okay, very good. Very good. 
you know, look at how different he is from yours. He's similar. He's got that strong square pattern on the back, but yours is black. Yours is much blacker. Very exact. Same one I've got. Notice the difference in color. Yeah. 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 Ye